Yep. <laughs> that is a gorgeous fish. So these reels we're using today, we've all got these low profile I'm kind of bait caster reels. You know, if you do any largemouth bass fishing, you certainly know, are familiar with that reel style. And it's something that's starting to really catch on in saltwater as well. And part of the advantages of it for, you know, say this kind of fluke fishing, not only is it smaller, um, you know, a little bit lighter in hand, it makes it easier for the jig, a little bit more fun to fish with. But I love having the push button control right there, especially somewhere like here on Nantucket Shoals, where you're going to go through, oop, that was one right there. You're going to go through a lot of different depth changes throughout the course of the day. And being able to make those quick adjustments to make sure that your jig or your rig is always right on the bottom. It's got a thumb bar right there, and that just makes it so simple to let out line. And also, you just see how small it is in the hand, how compact. Really lightweight, really fun to fish. What's our, uh, what's our speed over ground? One seven, it's good. Yeah, we're moving good. Yeah, that moving water is so important. Not only, I mean, the fluke are going to feed more when the water's moving, and you're covering more ground too. Because the, it's funny, you will go through a, a patch where you, you know you'll drift 100 yards, you won't do anything. Then you will go through a, a 50 foot stretch where the fluke it, it must look like a like a roof, like a tile floor down there. Well, there's so many. I'm like you saw when we first dropped, we all had. Uh, it's a good fish. Had bites. It's a good fish. If it's the right kind, it's a nice one. It's heavy. Whoop. No, oh, good fluke, good fluke. Oh, yes. Nice fish. All oh, right. <laughs> yeah. That's a good one. That's what we That's came for. That's a boys. real good one. Wow. Look at oh. that. Oh. All right. So we got the pen fathom on the battalion's low pitch rod that we're giving a go this trip on the fluke. And very fun fight. Um, on the slow pitch rod, absolutely love the feel to it. Nice backbone. This is what you come to the shoals for, these nice fluke. This is a fat one right here, and it ate um, the uh, pink and white with a little uh, pepper flake gulp. And I, I'm fishing a backwater baits ball jig with a glow head and a little pink and white uh, skirt on it. That's been the one that's been getting the bites from me. I like Jimmy culling out some of the smaller fish. I did, I did just get this one out of the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, God, just keep that tight, keep that tight. I'm, slow, I'm slow, just slow, trying slow, to reel slow. down on him. I'm just oh, trying to man. reel down on him. I can't get him oh, off wait. the bottom. This is, this is what I cleared out for you. Thank you. <laughs> so guys, when I'm fighting this fish, I'm just trying to get him off the bottom right now. And the first thing I want to do, I'm not going to do a lot of pumping. I'm really just going to keep a steady reel on this fish. Oh, he's right there with Jimmy. Nice fish. Got him, got him, got him, got him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That is a gorgeous fish. That's an extra large fluke. That's awesome. Jimmy, to your point, the pickup on this, 85 feet of water, I still thought that thing was down 40 feet, but the retrieve is so quick. Yeah, so this is actually, they have two models of it. This is the higher speed one. And it'll tell you right here how much it picks up per turn. 43 inches per turn for a little reel like that. Just a little powerhouse. Which is crazy because I still thought that fish was down 30 feet. Oh, so this he actually went for the jig. He went for the jig. That is a gorgeous fish, guys. Fishing Nantucket, guys. Fishing the, the shoals out here of Nantucket. That's what you can make the run out for. Just a beautiful fish. Chris, close to a nine pound fluke. That is beautiful. 